We begin in the ABC 7 Alert Center with breaking news. The dominoes continue to fall as another Conference USA school appears to be out. Still, despite teams jumping ship, UTEP remains on board with CUSA. ABC 7 Sports Director Adrian Ochoa is live in the studio with the very latest. Adrian. Yeah, Eric, that school leaving the conference is Southern Miss. And I told you on Wednesday that Southern Miss was looking at joining the Sunbelt Conference. And according to multiple reports, they've accepted the invitation today and a formal announcement is expected to be made next week. Now, after yesterday's exodus of the six teams departing for the American Athletic Conference, that left the USA with only eight remaining members. Now you can take the Golden Eagles out and we also may be taking out Marshall and Old Dominion. Reports are that those two schools will be joining the Sun Belt as well. So when that happens, only five CUSA schools re will remain. I told you Conference USA was looking to add James Madison, but James Madison is also expected to join the Sun Belt Conference. Conference USA has to start filling these holes, and they need at least six teams to remain at the FBS Division I level. According to Yahoo Sports reporter Pete Thamel, Conference USA has contacted NMSU, Tarleton State, and Sam Houston State about possibly joining these these teams again compete in the WAC for basketball and other sports. Of course, NMSU is an independent for football. Again, CUSA speaking with these programs according to Yahoo Sports. Now we contacted UTEP Athletic Director Jim Center. Wouldn't comment on any of the speculation, but he did say he's confident the minors will be an FBS in an FBS conference. Conference USA's commissioner is also confident that CUSA will stay afloat. What she is saying coming up later in sports. All right, Adrian, we'll 